Today we're going to use a new way of adding bigger numbers together. And this is a new method. You may have heard of it before, but it may be new for you. And it's called partial sums addition. Even if you have your own favorite way of adding numbers together, try this method today and see how it goes for you. The first thing you're going to do before you try this new method is make your estimate or your ballpark estimate as they call it in everyday math. And we worked on this in class so you should know how to do it. So go ahead and do that now. And 43 is closest to 40. 26 is closest to 30. So 40 plus 30 equals 70. And that's your estimate. The first thing you're going to do is add your tens place together. So I have 40 in this tens place and 20 in this tens place. So I'm going to write it out like that. And I know 4 plus 2 is 6, so 40 plus 20 is going to give me 60. The next thing you do is the same thing but for your ones place. So I have 3 and 6 in my ones place. I know that 3 plus 6 is 9 and I want to make sure when I write it that it lines up in the ones place here so I'm going to write it over on that side. And now I add 60 and 9 together and that's going to give me 69 and I'm going to check to make sure that 69 is close to my estimate of 70 and it is. Now let's take a look at home link. This is a uh, home link 2.6 and the first thing again is you're going to make a ballpark estimate and here we're using larger numbers now so I can do an estimate to the nearest hundred if you prefer. Around 245 to 200 92 is close to 90, so my estimate is 290. Now for this one, I have a hundreds place, a tens place, and a ones place, so I need to do each of those. And I'll start with the hundreds place. That's fairly easy. I have 200, and there's zero in this hundreds place, so 200 and zero will give me 200. Next up is the tens place. Here we have 40 and 90, so I need to add 40 to 90. I know that 4 plus 9 is 13, so 40 plus 90 is going to be 130. And finally, the ones place, we have 5 plus 2. And you should know 5 plus 2 is 7, but just make sure that that's lined up here in the ones place. And now you just add those three together. So 200 plus 130 plus 7. Can you add those three together? Ones place will give you 7, 3 in the tens place, and 200 plus 100 is a number of 3. And that is close enough to my estimate. Let's quickly look at one more. Here's number two. Um, we're going to do an estimate to the nearest hundred for these two numbers first. So we know our answer is going to be close to 300. Now let's go bit by bit. First the 100's place. Then you'll do your 10's place. And then your 1's place here. Then you're just going to go ahead and do your answers. I'll get you started here, but the rest of this, I think you should be able to do this part by yourself and then get the final answer. So that's how you use, again, the partial sums addition. There is a way you can do it without doing this part. Just a quicker way if you can do it in your head. I might show that to you later. But just try to do the rest of these on your own, and good luck. Thanks. Made with DoodleCast Pro.